To keep on track for his 3,000 ounce goal, Tony must take a gamble on the other piece of ground ready to sluice. We uh, have, I think, a fair amount of pay left in Monica's cut. It's a strip, it's ready to go, so why not give it a shot? The plant is still set up, everything is still there. Put the must on the key and let's lose some more of that material coming out of it. You've been thinking about this spot for 30 years? Why don't I come here? Last season, Monica Beats opened up a cut on Hunker Creek. Old time dredges produced a million dollars a day here, and she believed they missed this spot. Mike, what just happened? But hit roadblock. No, oh, just exploded. After roadblock. Holy Are you serious? Should have named it the cursed cut, not the hunker cut. And was eventually frozen out with under 400 ounces to show, earning it the name of the cursed cut. See you next spring. <laughs> Uh-oh. No way. All the water's going through your gut. It's a mess. We must have a jam of sticks and crap over there. And that just brought the water up enough to cut through. Trees washed down by winter storms have dammed Hunker Creek, diverting it right into Monica's cut submerging the gold-rich pay dirt under two and a half million gallons of water. Now, the original creek bed is bone dry. There's the one with all the roots and then there's the bigger one. So, I mean, that must have blocked the water off, brought it right up, popped it out over there. Anyway, no matter what, no use looking at it. I'll dig the out. How? You know any local beavers? No. Tony has no option but to try and redirect the whole creek and drain the flood water. You know what, if we get enough gold out of it, I'd be warded. 